People, there's just like a little forested area over there and people go in and build little fake tents out of trees and stuff. So he's now met with the dudes that run this eco farm here. Like I said, they learn beekeeping, they learn about planting, they have a little nursery and stuff. Um, we were actually supposed to go out and help two weeks ago, but the night before, we were getting ready to go at about seven in the morning, that night, uh, the one of the sheep had a bunch of baby lambs and they were all stressed out and they said it's better not to have strangers in when there's a bunch of baby animals. So the Yarkon, the river itself, is behind that white fence. We're talking. Is this on video? <laughs> of birds here, ducks and uh... So he's been teaching me how to recognize birds by their flights and their, you know, visuals and in repayment mm. I help him with Hebrew. So whenever he doesn't know what's going on, I translate. Right. Let me try again. This is so exciting, I've never been on this path. We have one of uh, our daily walks when we live here. Oh wow. Straight ahead on the rocks, I don't know how good the camera is in the light. There's a bird. I can't tell from here because it's a little too shadowy. It might be an Egyptian goose and it, it's walking like an Egyptian goose. Yeah, it's an Egyptian goose. Um, they have darker heads and uh, they steal up a bunch of resources needed by other <laughs> Weird people and <laughs> 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 